Well, hello everyone out there. This is Jambi Cakes again, and today we're going to be playing more Pokemon Fire Red Rocket Edition. And last time we we left off here in the city um, with uh, Lieutenant Surge and stuff, and we have to apparently help him with a drug delivery. That's that's a little sketchy, but I guess it's not beyond uh, the scope of Team Rocket's whole deal. <laughs> so hopefully uh, this will go pretty well. Hmm, yes, I'm one of Professor Oak's aides. What? No, no, that's AIDS. A-I-D-E-S, see? Oh, okay, see, I, I was worried he was going to be like Jared's aides. Yeah, he's like Jared's aides. Uh, we're careful about pollution here. We've heard Grimer multiplies in toxic sludge. Let's see what's over here. This is, uh, hi, do you have a Spiro? Want to trade it for my Farfetch'd? No, I don't. I already have one. So I'm good. I'm good on that. <laughs> uh, we got the Pokemon Fan Club. Now, I remember originally this guy's like super into his Pokemon. Uh, I chair the Pokemon fan club. I raise more than 100 Pokemon. I'm very fussy when it comes to Pokemon. I surely am. Hmm, what's that R stand for? Haha, <laughs> I bet it's Rapidash, isn't it? Oh, yeah. This is Rapidash. Ah, you have good taste. Yeah, uh, originally this man just like goes off about his Rabidash in a very unhealthy way. 
Uh, I just adore my seal. It's so lovable. It squeals Kiyu when I hug it. That is adorable. I guess I also hugged it. Got a Pikachu here. Hmm. My Pikachu is twice as cute as that one. Which one? Which, which Pikachu? Uh, our chairman is very vocal about Pokemon. Got the the gym down here. I have to cut to uh, to get through. Oh, okay. Here we go. Uh, Proton, a lonely grunt walking around Vermillion by himself. I take it you're the one they sent to help me with the smuggling deal. Well, did you bring the goods? Fine. Move over. What a meaningless thing to plant a tree right in front of the entrance to a gym. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty dumb. I never understood that. Well, you coming? So so you have to have cut. I used this move before you go here. Well, before I go here, I, I want to check out some other places first. Sorry, Serge, you're going to have to wait. Pokemon delivery has to be the most inefficient means of communication ever, don't you think? I think my brother has just been reading too many fantasy novels. Yeah, I agree. I'm getting my Pidgey to fly a ladder to Saffron in the north. Useless. Dear Pippi, I hope to see you soon. I swear I've never been to the underground path. That was just a lie Susie said because she's jealous. Best wishes, John. Oh no. Oh no, he's getting set up. <laughs> Alright, what's in the mart? What's in the mart? Show me your balls. Hi there, may I help you? Um, I have like no money still. So, these are pretty useless to me. Nah. I think Pokemon can be good or bad. It depends on the trainer. Yeah. They say prominent politicians will be attending the party on the SSN, but I couldn't afford a ticket, and I'm not good-looking enough to get in without one. Oh man, feels, bro, feels. I got, I, I, I got, I got the feels right there. Oh, sorry about that. Um, is the is Snorlax over here? Oh, there's Diglett. There's some trainers here. Um, I don't know if I should wait or go ahead and fight them. Or do the uh, Lieutenant Surge first. Um, <laughs> why not? Let's, let's go see what's over here. Let's go, but don't cheat. Mm, 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 mm. Youngster Eddie wants to battle. Sends out an Ekans. Oh yeah, well, mine's weaker, so take that. Okay, so now we both are intimidated. How about you be paralyzed too? Oh, okay, so this is just this is just what it's gonna be. Of course. Of course. <sighs> well let's just bite him, I guess. Maybe maybe I'll get lucky and not get poisoned. And get through all the paralyzations. Hmm. Of course. There it is. Yep. The beginning of the downfall. Maybe I can wrap him. Well, this is going to be... Alright. All right. Hopefully that'll be doing something, so at least while I'm paralyzed, I'm still doing something. It's close. Uh, 
That does almost nothing. Okay. Alright. Sweet. I beat the stronger Atkins. I am the true Atkins man. I am the snake master. Um, no, no reason to steal his Ekans. If you're if you're new to this, and you haven't seen the other one. Yes, I can steal trainer's Pokemon, but it gets me a bounty, so it's not always the best plan. Um, let's get Harvey out there and see if I can get some XP for him. Uh, I just became a dra trainer, but I think I can win. Okay, he just became one. Let's see how strong he is for just becoming one. Dylan. I don't think I've ever seen that spelling. Alright, Sans True. This is a perfect, perfect matchup. Just perfect. <laughs> Uh, let's just keep flying at him. Yeah, I really don't want to get hit by that. Owie. Hopefully I'll land this. <laughs> nah, at least I reset his rollout. Okay. Good, 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 good. Way to go, Harvey. A little bit more. Let's uh, let's just keep them out. Get some more XP. Let's. Um. Do I have something better for him? Yeah. I'll I'll use my sand true. Oh, you have wing attack? That's not going to save you. No. I will roll out your death. <laughs> Harvey grew to 14. Nibbles gained 85 XP. Once again, I've got no money. Steal a Pokemon from this trainer. No, thank you. Um, just more, more, more young trainers here for me to steal from. And then there's an old guy. I can also steal from old people. So that that's good. Youngster Dave. This child's name is Dave. It's a that's an adult name. Oh, of course. Why not? Getting pumped. Uh, let's just do this again. There it goes. Uh, Nidorino. Let's let's change him out. That's 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 put out even a boat. Yeah. Let's just water gun him. Should be okay. Yeah, be alright. It'll take a minute, but I'll get there. Question. Do I want to steal the Nidorino? Hmm. What do we think? Steal the Nidorino? I mean, why not, right? I may. I, am I going to use it? Maybe. Yeah. All right. Let's do that. Yeah. I'm awful. 
give it a nickname? Okay, let's think. Um, what do I want to nickname this bad boy? Let's name him... Let's name him Buster. I like that name. Buster. Um, yeah, when I, when I was young and I was playing Final Fantasy Tactics, yes, I, I, <laughs> I, I was around for that. Uh, one of the first characters I named was Buster, and I don't know why, but I just liked it at the time. And I remember, oops, I remember I was very sad when he died. <laughs> And he did not. He did not come back to life. Wait, uh, oh, that's right. I'm poisoned. Uh, I should be okay though. Let's. Audrey needs some experience, and hopefully, this will be a good place for that. Competition. I can't get enough. Hmm. Well, let's see what you have. Why don't we? Jasper would like to battle. He's got a bell sprout. Of course he does. He's a copycat. <sighs> Harvey would be great for this, but Harvey is poisoned. Let's use growth. Why am I not surprised? Come on, Audrey. Wake up. Oh, I don't like this, Audrey. Wake up. He's doing he's doing what I should have done and put me to sleep first. This could be bad. And now I'm stuck in the battle. Great. This could have gone better. This could have gone much better. But I goofed. Oh, Audrey. Why are you this way? Great. He's fully powered. This could not have gone any worse for me. Just, just do something. Ow. You know what? I need to sleep you too. Yes. Yes! Let's see how you like it. I won't get as greedy though. I'm just gonna do this once and then try and kill him. He woke up immediately. Of course. <sighs> oh, Harvey, I, I really am going to need you to land this fly. I, I got hurt by poison? I didn't know I could. that could happen. Luckily, he still has no defense. No, send it out. Is this going to kill me? Nope. It did not. But I will have to peck. Be honest, this battle could have gone better. But, it's okay. I'm still in it. And... I have Philip, who does not have a bug move, but does have confusion. So that's good. 
just as good. No, no need to. But I am gonna go heal. Luckily, they still heal me even though I'm a scourge to society. Mmm, all held up. Do, 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 do. I hope you guys like my new layout. Worked really hard on it. not it's not the best but but at least it's something I guess like I don't I don't mean like it's not it's not good I like it a lot I just feel like I could organize it a little better I don't know <laughs> I was just really excited to get started playing today. This game's been a lot of fun so far. It's a Heckins. I don't feel like fighting it. I do want to fight this kid though. I'm the best in my class. I train every morning. Train what? Youngster Yasu sent out a Rattata. Now then, you know it'd be great if this would work. Yes. Now hopefully he'll stay asleep. Stay asleep, stay asleep. I do like this. I just want one more. I'm a greedy boy. It's fine, Whippo. Yes! That's what we like to see here. No. Send out your next rat. Yes. Focus energy. You should have focused on quick attacking me. Go, Audrey! Poison powder. Um, I don't think I need this. There's no point. Yeah, send it out. That's unfortunate. Oh, hopefully it does not hit four times. There it goes. Just two. Ha ha. You fail. You lose. No reward. No cake. No nothing. You just let. You, you die. You go home now. I don't even want your Pokemon. That's how much you suck. An escape rope. There is no escape for you. I have never won before. Well, um, that is unfortunate because you're about to lose big time because I will probably steal that Growlithe from you. Um,. No, let's use let's use Vaporeon. Ember. Ember alert. That's awful. Uh Volp. You know what? This made this made my choice harder. Because now I want the Vulpix. 
I very much would like that Vulpix. I think stealing the Vulpix is the only answer. I mean... Yeah. It's a Vulpix. That's, that's getting taken. Yes. Now, let's see if it, what gender it ends up being. Because they seem to change, and there's no rhyme or reason. Of course. Naturally. Okay, let's think. Let's think for a second. Male Vulpix. He changed, he changed his identity. Let's name it... Let's name it Mozilla. All right, now I got that. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> I uh, I didn't I didn't fight this guy yet. Whoops. Engineer Braxton. That's a name. Sorry if your name's Braxton. I'm sure I'm sure it's a fine name. Let's think. Uh, I don't have anything great for this. Can use we can use nibbles for now. Um. Yeah, I know. <sighs> of course. So of course, Supersonic, when I'm trying to roll out. Oh, that's not good. Swift? Nope. Yeah, the Sonic Boom is uh, really messing me up here. And I guess that's why they gave it to him. Uh... Go Philip. Sleep. Thank you, Philip. Please stay. Please stay that way. While I try and confuse you. <sighs> Immediately wakes up. Immediately. Immediately. What what even what even is this? <sighs> I'm gonna get taken down by one magnemite. That's what's about to happen. Who, who would win? A full team or one magnet boy? I didn't mean to do that, by the way. Let's... I don't know, Nagini? Nagini? 
Yes, lower his attack that he's not using. Show him who's boss, Nagini. Bite him. I... Do I want this? He's messing me up good. Do I want to steal it just because it's annoying me? And then it, I would feel better? I think so. I think I'm going to take it from him. Just because he really pissed me off. Oh, right, I can't, because he's, uh, he's too old. I really just got <laughs> stomped by a, by, by a Magnemite. That's not good. That, uh, that's unfortunate. All right, let's see what's, uh, what's going on in here. Let's look at the uh, the Pokemon we got. We got a Vulpix. Let's see if he's any good. Tim timid nature. Um. Yeah. <clears throat> let's um. Let's use him. Who should we take out, though? Um, am I feeling Sand Slash? I don't know. What? What did? What? What? Uh, what do I need? Sorry about that. My cat's uh, having a having an attack back there. I guess. I want to keep this. I was asked to use this. The butterfree. I just like. Let's uh, let's get rid of you for now I think no I don't know <laughs> I'm off for this I think I <laughs> this is a hard choice for me because uh, I kind of want to use it and it because its name is so adorable And Harvey helps with a lot of things. What is what is, what is this going to help with? Anything useful? You know, I hate to do it, but I'm gonna I'm gonna place him over there for now. <coughs> mm. Sorry about that. I had to sneeze. Okay. No. I am definitely using this Vulpix, though. Let's go back over this way a little. <laughs> if I can remember which way I am going. I didn't fight all these trainers yet. I have never lost. 
Well, I hope that's true for you. Gambler Dirk would like to battle. Sent out a Voltorb, which could be mine. Okay, these Sonic Booms are really getting getting old fast. Well, at least now I know he's going to use Rollout and not Sonic Boom. That was some good XP. Use Magnemite. I finally have an answer to that. Fire spin. Thunder shock me if you want. You're still trapped in my in my f flames that are doing hardly anything. Oh. Yes, I'm so excited about this. This timid, this timid fire boy. <laughs> burn, burn. Yes, I want the Magnemite that I couldn't have before. Yes. Let's name it, shall we? Um, let's go with Dan. Goodbye for now, Dan. Maybe we'll see you later. You're a rocket. Well, catching you guys, that's somebody else's job. I'm just a gate guard, okay? No one can blame me. Fair enough. My colleagues from the Saffron Gates told me to ignore any pink hair guys in Team Rocket uniforms. Oh, well, I guess there's nobody here then. I like how serious they are about their jobs over here. It's funny that the road through here is so narrow that just one Pokemon line in the way blocks all traffic. That's uh, that's like some of the roads where I live, actually. They're like two ways, but they're definitely not. Like, there's definitely no way two cars are passing through here. So if you're going one way and another car shows up, you get to... Uh, you get to play this game of chicken. Yes, for Pete's sake, I'm one of Professor Oak's aides. I just don't see why everybody thinks that's so funny. <laughs> oh, oh no, Professor Oak. Let's see what the binoculars have to show. A big Pokemon is asleep on the road. Yep, yeah, sounds right. Uh, to get to Lavender Town from Cerulean City, Rock Tunnel appears to be a good route to take. Brock Tunnel. Brock Tunnel. I'd take Brock's Tunnel. Shh. I say nothing. A Pokemon is sprawled out in a deep and comfortable slumber. <laughs> that, uh, that's like my wife. She'll kill me for that later. Um, Alright, let's think. We can move on now, or we could mess around in Diglett Cave. I don't feel like there's a reason to right now, so why don't we just uh, go continue the story.
Yes. Who's ready? Ready to continue the story. Yay! Dun, dun. This beat is jamming. Look, as far as I'm concerned, I've never seen you enter this gym, alright? All I know is that Surge gives me my paycheck at the end of every month, and I don't question nothing else. <laughs> Do these guys battle? I keep telling the lieutenant that this gym puzzle is the most absurd uh, skill devoid contraption ever invented. He just scoffs and calls me a lightweight. Yes, this puzzle is awful. I remember <laughs> watching my friend Chrissy Bear's TV, shout out, his stream of Pokemon Red, and I think it took him 10, maybe 15 minutes to finally get the puzzle done. Had to look it up, I remember, because he wouldn't believe me. He wouldn't believe me that, that I was telling him that the Switch would be next to the first one, but it's fine. Uh, did you know that Lieutenant Surge was in the war? Yeah, you do? Maybe that's because it's all he ever talks about, yeah. Yeah, he does. Oh, only trash. 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 Why is there trash in here? Trash. Und so, like, every time you want to solve the puzzle, you gotta dig through all the waste to see if there's a button at the bottom. So dumb. You can tell, you can tell this man has some kind of, committed some kind of war crimes. You know, Surge has numerous kills during his time in the army, but what fascinates me most is that he managed to pilot a plane when he's seven feet tall. Oh yeah, I guess there's like a height restriction. The man is seven feet tall? Good lord. Oh, Lieutenant Surge, you're so strong. We don't stand a chance against you. Yeah, you're wicked powerful. It's a shame we didn't bring a Diglett. Oh, please, Surge, can't you tell us how you and your Pokemon got so strong? We want to be like you, too. Ha ha, ha. Well, I'll tell you, kids. Exercise your body by pushing yourself a little harder every day. Make sure you and your Pokemon both are taking your vitamins and getting a good night's sleep every night. And remember, it's real important that you always eat your meats and your veggies. Haha, <laughs> that's the way to do it, kids. Good luck. Wow, this is actually very insightful and good advice. So I wonder I wonder what kind of heinous thing he's gonna he's gonna talk about in a minute. Did you hear that? We can be strong like Surge. Come on, let's go work out. It's probably probably just that he's on steroids, you know. Yeah, man, I can't wait. I think I have some vitamins at home. We can go take them right away. So yeah, it's like uh, it's like the whole thing with bodybuilding. The uh, everybody tells you that all you need to do is just work out really hard and eat right. And they always neglect the part where you need copious amounts of vitamin S. Well, if it isn't my favorite little rocket man, how are you? Not not scared lifeless from old Lance's paranoid new crime fighting measures, I hope. Ha! Anyway, I take it you brought the regular goodies? Yes, as a matter of fact, this grunt here has brought a particularly strong yield straight from our top chemists. It's his promise, Serge. Well, I'll be. You guys are really something. Let's have it then, little buddy. Jam Jam delivered the steroids to Lieutenant Surge. Yeah, I did. Now, Surge, the Pokemon, if you'd be so kind. Oh, yeah, that's right. The Johto Beast, right? Yeah, I had my guys stock them in crates and hide them somewhere aboard the ship. Don't worry a bit about getting yourselves on board. The doormen all happen to be my folks, too. Excuse me. Um, they'll let you in as long as I drop them a word. Sound alright? Alright, alright, alright. 
So are you telling me that the crates are st <laughs> all still aboard the ship? You couldn't have done us the courtesy of carrying them on land? Now, Proton, easy. Do you know how heavy those darn things are? If I was to go carry those all by myself, my whole back would snap in half, I tell you. Anyway, don't you get all worked up just yet. You gotta look at things from the bright side. I don't know if you heard, but they're throwing this exclusive party right on board tonight. Rumor has it that some powerful political figures might even be attending, so you're lucky you could end up in some quite exciting company. How's that? Yes, going out to party with government officials is just what the rocket should be doing right now, isn't it? Sigh. Well, I don't suppose we've got much choice. Let's get going, Grunt. No use sitting around being bummed out about it. So, like, they got, like, the Johto dogs? Is that what he's saying? That doesn't make sense. Hey, you got some stuff to do, don't you, Rocket? Haha. -ha. Or did you just want to hear about me, about the time Electric Pokemon saved me from those Johto bastards during the war? So it was like the war between Kanto and Johto or something that they're alluding to? That's what I'm, that's what I'm gathering. Hey, don't you got you got stuff to do, don't you, Rocket? Haha. -ha. Did you want to hear about the? Yeah. Okay. He's got this. Say again. So, if they've got the the dogs, how do they get to Johto later? I guess that's the question. Well, I just noticed I leave little footprints. Like we all do on Mother Earth. Be proactive. Give a hoot. Don't pollute. Or do. It's your, it's your life. Welcome to the SSN. Welcome to the SSN. Excuse me, do you have a ticket? Oh, you're with the lieutenant? I see. Well, step right on up. On through, sir. The party has already begun. on one second guys I'll be right back Alright, sorry about that guys. I had to mess with uh, one of my settings. Uh, thank you, sweets. Ah, welcome aboard. That is quite the original party attire. Yes, I know. I'm the most ripped. There you are. Well, we better get searching. These Pokemon crates have got to be somewhere or other. Think they're with the captain? Bonjour, I am Liweto on the ship. I will be happy to serve you anything you please. Oh, never mind me. I'm just a regular old man going about my regular old man business. Ha ha. Ho ho. Ho ho ho. No mind me. Um, what's old man business? 
that's uh that's something I don't want to know about, I guess. What do you guys have to say? Oh, you guys are going to battle me. I love Pokemon to you. I didn't realize this was going to. Whoops. A Nidoran male. How nice of you. Let's send out Philip. Do you know what? Do you know what? You know what? He's confusion. That's okay. I can beat you before you beat me. Um... I, I don't need that Pokemon, no. What about this child? What does she have? I collected these Pokemon from all around the world. Hmm. Last Anne would like to battle. A Pidgey. This is what you've come to challenge me with? I mean, it, it's good against this. Hmm. How about we send out Nagini? Snakes are good against birds, right? The snake type. Oh, I flinched it. Amazing. Couldn't have worked out better. Nidoran female. Let's change. Let's give Mozilla some experience. I'm happy about her. Or him, rather. I forgot. I forgot he, uh. Forgot he changed on me. That hurt. I won't lie. I need to get a. I need a. I need to get another fire move on him besides fire spin. Can't even hear you eating mac and cheese in the background. Amazing. Amazing. Yes, I, I, I'll be honest, I am also eating mac and cheese in between talking. I, I hope it isn't like super noticeable, but if it is, uh, be jealous, I guess. Brick Break. That's a good TM. Shame I don't have anyone I'd want to teach it to. Audrey is up front, but she keeps getting robbed by having to fight the wrong typings. We are cruising around the world, my children and I. I need a bed. Is, uh, is there a place for me in here? I think maybe one of these will be my cabin. Or, oh, whoops. Ah, well, I guess I'm in the fight now. Uh, and of course it's a Nidoran. Right off the bat. I guess let's send out Harvey.
Let's fly. Oh, Audrey managed to get some XP for doing literally nothing. Um, no, I don't want stun spore. Uh, another Nidoran. Sure, let's just fly this one too. Forgot I was poisoned. Might die to that. Will die to that. Let's send out Vaporeon. Wow, I can't, I can't even see, I can't even see that little dot. It survived off of a dot. Not fair, I tell you. You rude child, you have no sense of courtesy. Steal a Pokemon from this trainer? No, because you know what? I'm courteous. Dick. Um, does she let me use her bed? It's my hobby to stare at trainers from around the world while they sleep. Will you humor me by having a rest? Yeah, alright. I wasn't given another option, but sure. Hmm, that was quite a delight. Your sleeping rhythms are pretty frantic. Do you have a bad conscience? Um, mm, no. What about you, sir? What do you have? I am but a solitary traveler. My sole companions and friends are Pokemon I call to my journeys. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Because so are mine. Audrey too. Um, once again. No use here. You know what? You want to intimidate me? I'll just send out Vaporeon. I was going to do out Nagini, but that seems silly. When I can just use Water Gun. That sounds like really painful. Those hits sound really, really hard. Like he's just getting like the absolute shit beat out of him with some bubbles. Um, grid level 16. About to use Vulpix. Well, Jim, Jam Jam change Pokemon. Um... No. Uh, water gun. Excellent. Excellente! Vulpix fainted. Now then, should I take the Growlithe too? Um... No, I'm not, I'm not gonna use Arcanine. And, uh, we're gonna move on from there. Should be nice to friends. Yeah, see, like, these are his only friends. Too. Like, how how big of a dick would it have to be? This, this man came up and said, my only friends 
or Pokemon that I have, and then I just take one. Ignore the fact that I steal from children constantly, and I stole a birthday gift from a child at the beginning of the game. I'm not that kind of guy. Waiter, I would like a cherry pie, please. I'm not the waiter. It's rude of you to assume. Did I go in here? Um, I don't believe so. A world cruise is so elegant yet cozy. I wouldn't know. I always travel with Wigglytuff. I never leave home without it. Wigglytuff. Poop. Poo poo. Um. Let's see what's down here. You, mon petit, we're busy here. Out of the way. Yes, my, my accents are spot on. Always. Never question that. I found one great ball. That's one great ball. Uh, I saw an old berry in the trash. I wonder what that was. Oh, was it leftovers? Ahem. Indeed, I am le chef. Le main course is. Is a barbecue. Le guess for mutiny, I fear. I don't blame them. Sniffle, sniff. I only get to peel onions. Sniffle. One chesto berry. That's what was in the trash. Did you hear about the famous man from Hoenn who's aboard with us? A handsome lad, but so picky with his palate. One cherry berry. Humdi hum ho. I peel spuds every day. Hmm. One pe pe pecka berry. Pecha berry? I'm not sure. That smells tasty. It might get the stomach growling. I'm so busy I'm gizzing, getting dizzy. You have to give me a room here. No. I don't think I do. Oh, sorry. Uh, time and place for everything, homie, just not now. Ah. Uh, I was wondering who would tell me not to do use items indoors. It's my homie. Uh, let's go upstairs. Because I feel like it. The ship, it, she is a luxury liner for trainers of the world. At every port, we hold parties with invited trainers. There's more upstairs. This looks like the place I'm supposed to be. So... Let's not go there yet, I guess. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what space I'm supposed to be at. And I don't want to go to this place I'm supposed to be yet. That's not the way I like to live my life. I hear there's a lot of commotion coming on by the balcony upstairs. I can't be bothered to check it. I'm too old for this stuff. Yeah, it sounds like uh, that's where I should be going. Oh, another battle. Check out what I fished up. Dale sends out a gold team. Finally, Audrey's time to shine. Let's use... Let's use one growth. And let's see if that's enough to get me through all these Fisher Pokemon. I, I really want her to evolve soon. I don't remember when it is, but I want, I want her to. Let's go Dean trying to set me up for failure. A tentacruel. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, I, I could not, I could not deal with that. Go Audrey too! Go Dean! Oh, no, no, I, I want to stay in. Wow, this could not have worked out any more in my favor. My firepower has now been weakened. Oh no. I am so scared. 
Like, I don't get the point of those things at all. Especially when, like, weather moves exist. Why? Competing against the young keeps me youthful. Gentlemen Brooks would like to battle. Pikachu. Let's just, uh, let's find with it. Woo, Pikachu! Uh, so close, so close to another level up there. Good match, I feel young again. Steal a Pokemon from this trainer. Ah, uh, no, no, it's fine. One Stardust. Finally! Money! It's money, guys. I don't believe it. 15 years ago, I would have won. 15 years ago, I wasn't born. You would have beaten a dream. I admire the captain's resilience. While the passengers are out battling each other and gloating over celebrities, he sits in his cabin smoking his pipe and honing his masterful cutting skills. Oh no, the captain's a cutter! Oh, hello, Chrissy. Welcome to the stream. They say the ship's captain is, an, is a legendary cut master. Oh, oh my god. He has inspired admirers for his cutting skills around the world. This man has led my, like, entire high school youth. He is the champion of the emos everywhere. Which do you find more worthy? A strong or a rare Pokemon? Um, what's the difference? Lamar. Lamar. Yes, yes. Sweets helped me out tremendously with getting my whole, my whole thing going. My, uh, my HUD. <laughs> Uh, so, Growlithe, have you met my boat? Yes, yes, my audio is better now because I actually have a headset now. One growly boy down. One growler flushed. Point, huh? No. So what are we thinking guys? Should we should we steal the pony ta? I like I'm not going to use it, probably, but I'll have it. Steal it? Okay. Be stealing it, boys. Water pulse. Yes. Yes. Yes, queen. Look at that, 60 and confuses. Perfect. It says na name it taco sauce, okay. I must salute you. Yes. We're taking the ponyta and we're naming it the taco sauce. Remind me of a Taco Bell pa packet. You mean like the ones that ask you to like marry you or like come away with me, Kachina. Fly with me, Kachina. 
Fly with me on my Taco Bell. On my Taco Bell sauce packet. I forgot what I was naming it for a second. I got wrapped up in that whole thing. Yeah, the ta the Taco Bell sauce be like. It'd be, be, it'd, be, it'd be very strong. It'd be like, peg me. Peg me after Taco Bell. I'm the worst at finding the letters. It takes me ages to remember where the alphabet looks like. Taco sauce was sent to box one. Oh, and now I'm immediately in a fight. Yeah, it just barely fits. I wasn't sure it was going to. My dad had me doll up for the party just in case Lance came by. Oh, yes. By the way, um, I'm, I'm on this boat now because, because Lieutenant Surge said... He he had the beast of Johto delivered on the boat, and I had to go pick them up. And in return, I gave him steroids. Dawn, Dawn. After this, she's going. She's going on her own Pokemon adventure. I need. I need to. Uh, I need to get Audrey off the team. Off the front. Oh yeah, and they also they also mentioned that his gym contraptions are very stupid and make no sense. And I mentioned how you got lost like forever. I forgot what he was sending out. Oh well, I'll just I'll just do this. When in doubt, show them your snake. Bites, bite it, bite the rats. You see, th this is this works because it's snake versus mouse. The snake type is strong versus the mouse type. Everyone knows that. You see, you just think about it, and Pokemon just well, it just makes sense. Do I still? Yes, I do still have. I still have a Pikachu. And I, I recently caught a Vulpix as well. Oh, 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 I want to see Lance so bad, but my dad won't let me. I haven't returned, I haven't returned any Pokemon yet. I've just, just been taking. Dragon Pokemon are evil and demonic. The way that Lance openly flaunts them, I do not approve of this region's blasphemic, blasphemic culture. Um, I'm going to take a sip of water real quick. Okay, I said I said a sip, but I, I, I gulped it down like it was something better tasting than water. Yeah, Christian trainers. I know, right? I only train pu Pokemon pure the Lord. What's <laughs> what, what do you what do you think's the purest Pokemon? They say that in all his decades of commanding ships, the captain has never been seasick. Ah, a resolute soul as well as artistic ability. He is the man. He is my man. Arcanine. Arcanine is the most pure. What about um what about Rapidash? You have to be like a pure soul to ride one. Seems like a good Christian Pokemon. Yeah. 
He's also like a legendary, according to his Pokedex entry. All the people over here are obsessing with the political guests. We admire the captain so much more. The way he cuts is a masterful work of art. It really is. My goodness. They, they just really... He must really be good at it. What does this guy say? It is I, Garson, the greatest chef in all of Kanto Joto. Why is he not down with the other chefs? Oi, tis true. Did you come from my le autograph? My le autograph? No. Oh, the captain. He is not to be disturbed, for he is busy consuming my very own smoked magic cup extraordinaire. It must be enjoyed in quite seclusion. I do. Come again later. I can't come back. Yes, my uh, my my French accent is terrible, and I'm not I'm not even sure why I'm even trying because I'm I'm definitely just insulting people everywhere. But then again, I'm Team Rocket, so do I care? Magic Carp canonically is bad, I thought. Uh, I mean, if he's a world-class chef, anything's good, right? I saw some powerful-looking guy flying here on a Dragonite. I think he's famous. But I'm not from around here, so I don't know. Okay, so... Can't be Lance. He, he doesn't have Dragonite. He, he only has... He only has things like Charizard and Gyarados. Real dragons. Come on then, my sailor's pride is at stake. It's sa his sailor's pride. It's the man, the sailor man, Sailor Duncan. Horsey. I, uh, I forgot to heal. It's okay. Yes, Sailor's Pride. The breakfast cereal. Start your day with a bowl of Sailor's Pride. And you too. Can be strong. Like your father that never came home. I don't know where I'm going with this. I don't know, it just sounds like some 50s cereal. Like, like, Wheaties, but it, but it didn't take off like Wheaties. I, I'm just gonna get bodied by this shelter real quick. My Sailor's Pride keeps me from using demonic dragon Pokemon. Yes. Well, I see, he he has an ice type to keep those evil demons away. That did nothing. And I did, I did totally just use a flying type when I straight up knew he had an ice move. Because that's the, that's the kind of person I am. Harvey's a bad... Yeah, Harvey is a badass. Wow, <laughs> the clear body, just just to rub it in, just to rub it in. No intimidate for you. Tell my wife she's hot.
You're hot. Thank you, thank you, Wishful Mayhem, for reminding me what I had long forgotten after, after 11 young years. <coughs> I, I want to fight the sailor, but I, I think I need to heal my Pokemon first. Way to call yourself out like that, but all right. I kind of figured. And also, way to use my name. <laughs> but that's fine, I guess. Animosity, eh, anonymities for chumps, right? It's a shouter. One hundred percent. Just I wanted to keep him here, and I didn't at all wanted to use a grass move at him. Did I really miss that? Oh, it's a protect. That's what happened. I'm over here looking at chat and not paying attention to a Pokemon battle. Okay, Audrey 2 is w way above my other Pokemon and levels now. I, I need to uh, I need to put someone else in there. How about... We... We level up my little, my little Vulpix here. Mmm, I like feisty guys like you. I like that immediately, immediately, I got into a fight with a water type trainer. Thinking, surely there was no more. I think, I think I'm just gonna, I think I'm just gonna try and train up Philip here. You like the name for Bell Sprout? Thank you. <laughs> yes, the the one the one trainer that likes feisty kids. Let's see, they fight harder. He he likes a little struggle to keep the uh, the meat the meat tender. Smoke screen. It's uh, it's just the new age uh, sand attack, I guess. Of course, see, unfortunately, because I've been not sand attack to death, I think I'm gonna have to switch out just so I can hit somebody. Let's train up my little sneaky. Yeah, the sound effect on Water Gun 
sounds really painful. Like, I'm getting sprayed down with a literal fire hose. Or like... I don't know. Like, airsoft gun or something. Another horsey. Why not? This, the seaman and his team of three horsies. Have you seen Horsey's face? Yes, it is the perfect receptacle for seaman. Use use my hotkeys. I will use them when when the situation demands it. And not Did this man just say no homo to me? First of all, all of the homo to you, good sir. <coughs> second. I don't have a second. But you straight up told me no homo. Another, fu another fucking session. Of course. What did I? What did I expect? More, more fishmen. I just want to train up. I want to train up this little Vulpix, and it's just nothing but water Pokemon on a boat. Who, who, who would have thought? The top floor didn't have all these these little fucks. Huey, Tentacruel. This should work, cause I have confusion. Yes. Yes. Fall for my butterfree. This man, this man confused, tried to confuse me. It's time to level up, guys. Philip grew to 15. Star you. Hmm. What? What should I use for star you? Let's just keep in, uh, let's just keep Philip in. Harden. Sorry, your defense won't save you now. I I love I love this man's dedication to getting hard. No homo. We caught all of our Pokemon while we were out at sea. Yeah, that, that, that tracks. Homo, yes. In this day and age, who amongst us isn't? <sighs> so, what are you two doing? In this one bedroom. Mm -hmm. This... This one bedroom room. I can't tell if you're from the seas or mountains, but stop and chat. All my Pokemon are from the sea. Okay, so there's two options. There's two options in Kanto. You either live on the sea or you live on the mountains. And there's nothing else. You either live on Groudon or Kyogre and you get nothing else. Is that a child and a sailor? No, no, this is not a child. It is. It is a fisherman. A fisher man. Not a fisher boy. Not a fisher price. A fisher man. Poop. 
picking up some male bonding. The, the best kind of bonding, if you ask me. Male bonding. Philip is trying to learn Gust. Philip is trying to learn another attack. I'm thinking that I want to get rid of poison powder because I actually like the other two stuff. And this will give him another uh, another stab option. Yes. A shelter. I I don't want to dick around with a shelter because I already learned my lesson last time. Poor, poor Volvix. I just call I just call him, and he's timid. By the way, he's a timid nature, which is really good for Volpix. So close. This man. This man, the audacity to tackle me when I know straight up he could, he could just freeze me. Um, no, that's, that's just, let's not play around. This is Audrey's time to shine. I love how this man tried to recover nothing. This man is drunk. Please put this man to bed. Darn, I let that one get away. $56. Matey, you're walking the plank if you lose. That's, that's extreme. I guess I can't stop him if I lose. I don't like the way that much hop is looking at me. Arg, beaten by a rotten criminal. Oh yeah, I guess that, that would be why he'd want to throw me off the ship. When we're out at sea, jellyfish Pokemon sometimes drift by. That's a big... That's a big change in what you said. You said, if you beat me, you were going to make me walk the plank. And then I win and he's like, oh, you know, you know, sometimes we see sweet little jellyfish uh, off the, off the port. <laughs> Shot in the dark, found a hyper potion. Someone just threw that in a bucket. All right, I'm going to heal up and then we we're going to continue on and see what's happening up up on the uh, up on the decks. There's like a commotion going on. And maybe maybe I can steal myself something really nice. Some nice pretty pretty Pegasus. Actually, you know what? I should save because I haven't saved since I started this stream. And I feel like I'm going to pay the price for that. Hi, guys. Darn, I knew I should have shout out for an extra. Whew. Let me, let me, let me, let me get that sentence right. Shout out extra for a VIP ticket. There we go. Words. I want to see, I want to see what's going on. Who's here? Is it a movie star? Well, I'm going to go, I'm going to go and say yes. Oh, who's the gray haired one? He's cute. Oh, and so powerful. The gray haired one. 
I don't... I don't know who that is. I have paid too much money for my ticket to miss out on this. Apparently you didn't pay enough, sir. You didn't you didn't have the super shitters deluxe ticket to go see to go see Lance's dick. Get off the fucking boat. I've waited to see these figures for years. Oh what I wouldn't give for a handshake. Settle now now, settle down people. Our VIP guests have just finished the meal and are engaging in some private conversation. Their time is very precious. They are not to be disturbed without reason. Well, how do I look? How do I look? Can I let Lance see me like this? Oh. Oh, shit. It's fucking Lance. All this conversation did not lead me to believe Lance would be here. Oh, Steven? Steven? Steven's here? Fuck. Steven's here. I wonder if any of the other champions are going to show up. There's like no reason for Steven. For Teven. For Teven to be here. For Teven. It is a pleasure to finally get to meet you in person, Lance. I've heard so much about the state of Kanto affairs under your reign from my advisors, but I've always wanted the opportunity to discuss it with you personally. Like, does it? Doesn't Ru Ruby and Sapphire take place in the future from from these games? How old is Stephen? He's been champion for how long? Maybe. Are you optimistic about your region's future? Oh, let me tell you, Mister Stone. They're calling it the Golden. Yeah, I forgot his fucking last name is Stone. Uh, they're calling it the Golden Age of Kanto, but we're only just beginning. Not only have living standards increased dramatically in the post-war decade, but our economy is in an unparalleled boon. To think that Selfco, once a Kanto family business, now has near nationwide monopoly on the production of Pokeballs. Fusha Savari Zone is also attracting an ever-increasing mass of tourists. And that isn't even the, even to mention what the region's brightest entrepreneurs have in store for Saffron and Lavender Town in the coming years. Yes, Kanto has turned out quite the prosperous region. Rest assured, you know, it's dawning on me that maybe I shouldn't be here. Well, it sounds like private enterprise is doing well at the very least. How they even, why they even let me through here? But what of the people, Lance? Do they approve of you? I don't mean to draw unwarranted comparisons to the past, but I'm led to understand that your predecessor was quite universally revered, even though times were tougher then. Who is who's the champion before beforehand? How do you compare with him in the eyes of your citizens? Ha. Yes, my predecessor was loved by all. Up until the moment he surrendered from the war, that is. War. War never changes. Anybody with any sense stopped adoring a champion who would give up his region's independence and honor just to save his own skin pretty quick, I'll tell you. Look, I know that having conquered Kanto in war as a Johto general necessarily means that some of my citizens won't take kindly to me right away. But I dare say, my entry in the history books will be more favorable than that old coward's. I see. I hope you'll excuse my lacking. Both in political experience and memory, but... What was the name of this predecessor of yours again? Hmm... His name, his name was Samuel Oak. I, I fucking knew it. Stop yawning. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know why. I've had a long day. I'm sorry. I'm certainly not apt to forget that anytime soon. Oh, that's right. And this Oak, he has now given up battling altogether and resigned himself completely to his Pokemon research. I understand his Pokedex system has become quite renowned in academic circles. 
even in Hoenn, it's quite impressive. Heh. <sighs> oh, Mr. Stone, Oak didn't give up battling of his own accord. I saw to it that he was banned from ever taking part in the Pokemon battle. Again, the moment he called for surrender. I suppose his research endeavors were all he had left to attend to in his post-war life. Is that really so? I must say, your regent's political history intrigues me, Lance. If you don't mind me asking, why in the world do you think a powerful and respected trainer as this Samuel Oak would surrender without a fight? It seems so odd, so unlike a champion, wouldn't you say? I see no mystery in that whatsoever. We were winning the war, and the old man got scared for his life. Simple as that. Some high-level Kanto scientists were allegedly trying to make genetically engineered warfare Pokemon around then as a last resort, but nothing came of it. And once we got the legendary dogs under our control, victory was more or less guaranteed either way. Some Kanto patriots may like to tell the story different, but that's the truth of it, Mr. Stone. Hmm. Well, it was an interesting turn of events in any case, I have to say. Well, I'm glad I could keep you entertained. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm afraid I'll have to leave you to attend to some Indigo League business. I hope you keep enjoying the Kanto air for as long as it lasts, Mr. Stone. Vermilion is a beautiful city. So, we're getting more backstory here about the war that apparently taken place. And I guess, I guess Lance was, they said that Lance was, was from Johto. And I guess he conquered, Can they conquered Kanto and he took over being champion because Oak just gave up. But I guess there's going to be more to it than that. I don't know. It's weird. It's like following the footsteps of the like sidely to the uh to the original games but it's it's wanting to do like its own story i guess i don't know at the en at the end of uh red and blue oak and lance didn't seem to have too much of a beef so i don't i don't know how that translates mm, yes it is quite an exquisite evening wouldn't you say I do believe the magic cart was a little too salty. Ah, yes. My own chef would never stand for this. You must not bother Ziho and Champion. Don't tell me what to do. This Lance has such a violent appetite. This party is moderately entertaining, but the parties on my own yacht are infinitely grander. Well, fine. Hmm, no, I'm quite full now, thank you. Oh, oh, okay. I didn't realize I was here to serve you. So, I still don't know where the dogs are? What the dog doing? I get. maybe I can talk to the captain now, who likes to cut his words. Ah, nothing like a full pipe of sailors backy after a meal. My, if only all my afternoons were this peaceful. Okay. It's empty. Uh, who the hell am I supposed to talk to now? Um, maybe, maybe I need to talk to him again. No. I'll try talking to Steven again. Somewhere on the ship I'm supposed to... I'm supposed to find the... Uh, the delivery. Wait, was this guy always here? Yeah. It's that guy. They didn't say if I needed to talk to anyone in particular. I don't or think. Uh, 
Um, quite full. Um, maybe, maybe I just need to interact with one of these. Well, I'm confused. What's new? Let's talk to this guy. Ah, there you are. Well, we better get searching. These Pokemon crates have got to be somewhere or another. Okay, so I have to find them somewhere or other. Are they just in rooms? I wish I wish I had uh, wish I had realized that. Do 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 do. Hmm. I'm not quite sure where they'd be. Does uh, does anybody here have any ideas where they could be? Did I talk to this guy? I have a looking guy. Okay, yeah, I did. Mm -hmm. We're in search mode, you guys. I'm thinking they gotta they gotta be they gotta be up here, right? There's like no reason. Hmm. This is the cafeteria. I think they're up front because there was no other reason for me to like to go to go up there and see all that cutscene if they weren't there. Either that or they're in the captain's crew quarters, and I just wasn't paying enough attention. I thought I interacted with these things. Yeah, I know, your yacht is better than my yacht. Uh, settle down. Hmm. This is uh, this is a head scratcher for sure. I'm gonna go back into the captain's quarters, I guess. And if not there, I'm gonna have to check every every door, I guess. Oh, it's right here. <sighs> wow. I really, I really did that. Hey you, trespassing on my cabin during my private time, are we? And who might you be? Well, judging by that outfit of yours, I'd say you're trouble. And I'd even wager you'd make it double. Oh, I see how it is. You came here to pick up those crates, didn't you? See, my crew found those things lying around on deck earlier, and I sure as heck don't remember loading them aboard in Lily Cove City. If this is part of some smuggling business, I'll have none of it. Let me show you how we deal with petty smugglers where I come from. I'll cut you right up. So, does this guy count as an old man? Can I steal from him? Captain Ara, <laughs> A tentacle. Go, Philippe. Super effective. I just noticed his levels. I might be, I might be in, I might be in danger. Let's um let's try sleeping him. 
he's very high level. I did not expect that. Whoops. I got excited. This uh this beat is jamming though. Well, that 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 was unfortunate. Come on, Audrey. You can do it. If I can if I can sleep them, that'd be great. Maybe this will give me time to set up. And I won't get ruffle stomped. Do I do I risk it? That's the question. Do I risk one more? Mm. Screw it. Let's go. I'm already here. I'm already in it. Let's do it. Beautiful. Beautiful. You just love to see that. Well, if Audrey can sweep this team, that would be fantastic. Oh, a Scyther. Wasn't expecting that. And Scyther's Definitely, definitely going to outspeed me, right? I'm going to have to switch. I wasn't, I wasn't prepared for that. Let's, let's see if, uh, if Mozilla can do it. That did hardly anything. Well, let's do another one, I guess. Hey, I already know he has pursuit, so if I try and switch out, I'm just going to get I'm going to get bodied. False swipe. I would love him to keep using that. There's no world where he does this again, right? A critical hit. False swipe. Come on, please. Please tell me he does it one more time. A super potion, of course. Well, I guess I got him to use that. <sighs> I know, I know as soon as I switch, he's just going to hit pursuit. I cannot believe this is, this is really happening. He keeps using false swipe. Is he, like, dumb? I, d I don't know. There's the pursuit. I'm about to finish him off and he pursuits. Of course. Of course! What a cruel world we live in. Well, that's some good XP for Harvey. Krabby. Let's change into Audrey. So he did have more waters. He just happened to have that one Scyther there to screw me up. Can I put him to sleep? That's the question.
No, I can't. Well, he hardened twice. Which means now I'm I, I'm just gonna I'm gonna get another free another growth. He hardened again. <laughs> this is hilarious to me. Let's just uh let's just take some swings at him. Those damn hardens. This damn hard crab. If it wasn't if it wasn't for those he would be dead. But I'd also be at level love lower health, so it evens out. What's next? Diglet. I will stay for Diglet. Sucker Punch almost messed me up. Yes, the level the level difference here was uh, absurd. Gosh darn landlubber, I'll have you arrested. Eighty dollars. Yes! I'm... I'm evolving! Finally! I'm so excited! This is amazing! I got a weeping bell! <gasps> I can steal a Pokemon? He did count as old. I am stealing something. What should I steal, guys? Guys, what should it be? Think it should be Tentacle, Crabby, Diglet, or hmm, Scyther. I think, I think it should be Scyther, guys. I took this man Scyther. Give it a name. Yes, let's give it a name. Um... Oh yeah, he they did say that this man likes to cut. I remember that. Hmm. Let's name him Rock. Rock was sent to box one. What the? My my Scyther, you filthy thief, you'll suffer for this. I'll have you know we have some powerful authority figures aboard this ship. I'll have you tried in national court if I have to, you smuggling, thieving little. Coffeine, poison gas, now. Heh. <laughs> Oh, yes. Isn't he, like, super sick? I've never been this sick in all my 50 years at sea. Darn it. Oh, you filthy cheating. Blah. Oh, my stomach is turning. Good witness. Nicely done, coughing. Now I, I need a coughing. I see you finally found the crates, Grunt. Good. It'll probably take a couple of trips to get them all out the ship, but we'll manage. I don't think this old guy is going to pose much of a problem anytime soon anyway. Let's get to it. 
Well, that's the last one. I'll have the Pokemon move to the appropriate location on my own. For now, I'm just happy to be off this ship. Pretentious parties and people of influence make me almost as sick as the swaying of the waves. Speaking of meaningless things, have a look at that. Whose bright idea was it to put some great big truck out on this tiny island out in the ocean? Well, I suppose it makes for a great place to hide something in plain sight that's out of people's reach. Go figure. That's funny. Well, what are you standing around for, Grunt? Mission's over. Nothing more to see here. I figure boss will have some other mission for you by now, Starboy. Head back to HQ and Celadon. I'm off. Welcome to the SSN. Well, guys, I think that's probably a good place to wrap up. So I'm going I'm gonna I'm gonna heal up. Before we quit though, let's uh let's look at let's look at let's look at what I got. We got taco sauce, the ponyta. Sassy. That makes sense. And run away. And we got rock. The scyther. It has technician. It's quirky, which isn't great. But it does have technician, which is fantastic. So... We may we may we may end up using him on the team. Anyway, I'm gonna save here, and we'll wrap up the stream. So thank you guys for coming out. I hope you enjoyed, and bye bye.